17 arrests, nine arrests early Tuesday morning, and eight others who were already in jail for unrelated charges, all part of Operation Bite Back. We're certainly taking some people off the streets this morning that uh, uh, were committing illegal acts within the community. The FBI, along with several state and local agencies, all teamed up to make these arrests. These are five of the people that were arrested Tuesday morning. Their charges range from distribution of crack, possession, stolen firearms, attempting to pass counterfeit money, robbery, and child endangerment. Many of these arrests are suspected members of different gangs in Batesville. We're still working on that case every single day. Champion says these arrests are indirectly related to the Jessica Chambers investigation. Chambers was burned alive one year ago near her home in Cortland. Since that time, multiple agencies have interviewed many different people, and Champion says the investigation has taken them to many areas of the country. Through the interviews, they learned information which ultimately led them to the direction of these arrests. I would be surprised if this is the end of it. As for the Chambers investigation, Champion says they're still working every day and he feels the case will eventually be solved due to technology. Or that technology will lead us to um, a suspect, but uh, you know, it's just we're in the process of learning new things.